Hey everybody, Chris Simmons here with createinsights.com. In this insight, we're going to talk about how you can grow your video business with membership organizations. A great networking opportunity for successful videographers. As you probably know, word of mouth is the cheapest form of advertising and usually results in the most profitable projects for your video business. In my experience, if a lead for a video project comes as a referral from one of my existing clients or many qualified referral partners, I know it's going to be much easier to close that sale and the budget will often be higher than projects that come to me from other forms of advertising. What are you doing to make sure you get a steady stream of referrals for your video production business? Here's a strategy that works well for me. Step 1. Join membership associations in your area where prospective clients are also members. This can be the local Chamber of Commerce, Manufacturers Association, Technology Association, Advertising Federation, etc. Look at your business, look at your clients, and then look at what member organizations are available in your area and see who they're members of and then visit those and consider joining them. Step 2. Request a meeting with the executive director or anyone in a management position at that association. As a new member, it should be fairly easy to get a meeting. Step 3. During the meeting, talk to them about their organization, what their main initiatives are, and if there is anything you can do to help them be more successful. In return, the conversation will move to what your business is all about and what they can do to help you be more successful. Be confident in your answers and make sure they understand exactly who you want to do business with. If you're a corporate videographer, they should know that you'd like to meet business owners and marketing directors, safety directors, HR people. If you're a wedding videographer, they need to know that you'd like to be introduced to other wedding professionals so you can develop referral relationships. It could be wedding professionals, catering companies, photographers, even if it's not necessarily lined up with weddings, you want to try to get connected with those vendors that could potentially serve the wedding market if they're not serving it already. If you're a freelancer, they can help you connect with other video production companies who also happen to be members. Before you conclude your meeting, ask if there are other managers you can meet within their staff. More introductions can lead to more relationships, which will result in additional referrals. And of course, I don't have to tell you that more referrals equals more business, and more business equals more money, which of course then results in a more successful video production company, which is what we're all about, right? Step four, find as many opportunities as possible to carry on the conversation with these people in the future. Every time you speak to these people again, you reinforce the relationship and you become top of mind for when video production opportunities arise. Also, it's pretty common for the membership organization to actually become a client since they will want to find ways to reward you since you invested your money to become a member in the first place. Step 5. Find ways to work directly with the membership associations. Every association needs your video production services in some form or another. Now that you're a member investor, you need to ask if you can submit a proposal when those needs come up. They will usually feel obligated to give the business to one of their members and in many cases you won't have a lot of competition. Every association that I'm a member of is also a client. I produce videos for them, I manage their audiovisual requirements at annual meetings and quarterly events, etc. All in all, I'd say that my memberships cost me about $1,000 a year, but the return on that investment is typically more than $30,000 a year in projects that come directly from the associations. Then tack on at least another ten to twenty thousand a year in projects that come from referrals that are made by the association staff or from other members whom I've met at various networking events. The bottom line: this is a low-cost marketing tactic that will get results for your video production business as long as you spend a little bit of time to actually meet these people and cultivate relationships.